Oh, no, 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 no. We got problems. Oh, spawn on death mechanics. Getting us. Run, 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 run. Oh, my God. Giant gorilla chasing us. Nothing I can do. There we go. Water. Water's the savior. Oh, no. Okay, that's fine. Kamikaze. Escape the gorilla. What's going on, guys? TBF Gaming. Welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Evolved. We're jumping once again into Center Eternal. Really excited to get going today. We just got done building a whole bunch of base stuff. I've got a huge base behind me because we had to break down the old base. I'm really bummed out about it, but let me go down here and show you real quick. So down here, we did have a little bit of a... Don't fall all the way. We had a little bit of a base going back here with the prehistoric mod. We had to remove the prehistoric mod. I'm really bummed out about it. It's an amazing mod. Nothing negative about it. It's just when we had too much of it on the server, it did cause a little bit of problems. It's some of those bigger mods like that, they definitely caused that. And because this new is not fully optimized yet, but it's an amazing mod, nothing negative. And when I run it on like a single player or a, a server where it's just me, I will definitely use it again because I think it looks amazing. But so we replaced everything with the S plus stuff and we're working on making kind of a cool base. Make sure we got something that we can be proud of up here. And we're going to talk a little bit about the other mods that we're using today because we didn't really explain them really well in the first few episodes because we just jumped straight into the action. So we want to talk first about the avatar mod. So this one is called Avatark. A A V A T A R K, I think, if I'm spelling it right. It's basically Avatar and then with a K at the end. But it's the Avatar mod. It allows you to get these different powers. You run up to this flag and you can receive any one of the bendings, air bending, earth bending, fire bending, and water bending. You can decide one of those. If you're an admin, you can do uh become the Avatar and then you can also enable Avatar uh for others, I think. I haven't actually tried it yet, so we are going to try it eventually, but there you go. Just really, really cool. We chose the fire one. If you choose a different one, you do have a cooldown before it actually lets you switch, if I remember correctly. So you do have to wait a little while. I think it's like 10 minutes or something like that. It's, it's a little bit long, so we won't do it right now, especially since I need the flight to kind of place things. Uh, but that's the Avatar one. If you look on the top left, you can see the little bar up on the top left. It shows fire is what we're using right now, and then it shows the bar for the amount of chi that we have. And then if you look at the different powers underneath there, you can change those by using like alt and mouse wheel and then I think the other one is alt tab oh no 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 that's to change screens it's not what we wanted hold on back on back on the arc screen maybe it was shift alt and mouse wheel no uh hold on no no <laughs> now, now I can't get it to work there we go it's shift alt and then scroll wheel and there's a couple other ones but that's how you change between them right now we've got the flight and we've got dragon punch and that one's pretty cool you just hold the alt button left click and it does that alt and right click will do my other power which is the fire shield that's the second power listed right there all right and then we can change our power here's our fire blast bam that one's pretty powerful dragon breath and then the this one's really cool this is the flare check this one out Oh, wait, we got to have a little more health. There we go. Bam! Throwing flares in the air. That way, when we're lost, Otto can come find us. That one is really cool. I really like that one a lot. We'll have to do it again at nighttime so you can really see it. It looks amazing. All right. Now, the other mod that we're playing with a bunch is called the... Wait, hold on. Make sure I say it right. The Stargate Worlds 3.0 mod. This one is cool. Here's the first thing in it. You have to make the Ancient Bench. The Ancient Bench is really cool because it allows you to make all the Stargate stuff, right? But it, it does act a little bit funny. I couldn't pull the items to my inventory. So if you try to make this, right, let me show you. I'm just going to show you guys so you guys understand. When you do Ancient Bench and you try to pull everything, it'll tell you that you have not enough inventory or space because there's a lot of stuff for it. I don't know if that changes if you have a lot more weight, but right now I have 252 weight and I can't do it. But yeah, so you got to kind of wait on that. But inside of here, you've got the actual Ancient... Uh, stargate you have the puddle jumper you have the rings you have the stargate pieces like the dialer and the stargate zpm i don't remember what zpm or dhd stands for i think it's dial home device i don't know true don't yell at me i i, I just can't quite remember it uh she geeks out about this. this is one of her favorite things it's awesome uh when she first saw this mod she was super excited all right so here it is the rings one of my favorite parts in this mod check this out let's get out so we can see it really well Look at this. This looks so amazing. Tell me that's not awesome. I absolutely love it. So it brings us up to the top of our base. And up here we got the little top part. You can kind of see what we got going on up here. Really cool looking. 
Really, really cool. And I'm liking this base build so far. Let's go get the other Stargate pieces so we can do this. We'll go down here. Dinos can also travel through this. I haven't tried multiple people yet, but it definitely works with like a dino or something in there. So we'll do that in just a second. No, not that one. All right, let's see. Where? Oh, I already have the Stargate. I didn't think I had it. So let's go back up top. And I was going to place the Stargate on this little front place. There we go. I think if it had if it has room, we're gonna place it right here. So we're gonna go Stargate. Oh, okay, it like clips to the actual foundations. Interesting. Bam. Oh, that is almost perfect. Almost perfect. It is off center by one, and that's driving me just a little bit crazy, but we can actually do something else. Hold on. We can do two of them, right? Bam. If I can get it to place over here, I'll do two sets. Because see how it goes like at an angle like that? Let's do that. Come on. Right there. That goes through a little much. So I need to build out a few more ceilings. Let's do this. Can I pick it up? Pick up Stargate. I need to extend out like two more. So let's go... Uh, let's can I make some more ceilings or do I have them? Oh, we do. Awesome. Ceiling. All right, like that like that. So we'll extend out. Let's see. How does one piece look? No, not that one. Uh, that one. All right, that's a little better. It barely clips into the actual base. Looks pretty good. All right, that'll work. That'll work. Let's go make one more, and we'll do that. Now, the DHD, I think it just has to be close to it to tie to it, right? I'm not really sure how it works. Okay, so it has to be somewhat close to the actual base here. Bam. Okay. Now, d we open the console. Oh, that looks just amazing. Hold on. we got to add the ZPM to the gate this one I think like that and now it's powered right I don't know if I did it right or not let's see open console allies tribe let's see is it dialing or did I mess up open console it didn't work what did I do wrong Hold on, did I not put this in right? Oh, there we go, there we go. Oh, oh, we got it, we got power, okay. Took me a second, there we go. All right, I don't know who's is who's. Let's go to that one. Oh my God, it's working. Oh my God, guys. Hold on, we gotta get a picture of this thing. Look at this. Oh, the lights are going. Oh, geek out moment, this is amazing. This is excellent, indeed. <laughs> this is cool guys hey as we're doing this if you guys enjoyed today's episode or if you enjoy what we're doing here on the channel hit that like button subscribe for new leave a comment down below all those kind of things you guys are awesome and amazing oh my god now it's a slow teleporter so we still have the regular teleporters on here but this one just kind of adds something look at that got one more oh my god <gasps> yes <laughs> full nerd out moment look at this Oh my god. Okay, I don't know whose base we're going through. Oh, please don't crash the server. I'm actually afraid. Huh. I'm a little afraid to go through. Please don't. You know what? I'm not even going to. How do I disconnect? Okay, because I don't know whose base it is. How do I, like, rename it? So it's not numbers. It's an actual rename Stargate. TVFG base there we go that is so cool man that is really cool all right sweet so we'll we'll try that out later because i'm a little afraid to go through it now it is a one-way thing you have to oh uh, what is someone dialing to us there was something going on <laughs> i don't know that was pretty cool is it gonna happen 
I don't know. Something was happening. Something was happening. We're good. All right. So we got we have power in our base. I still I still need to place a couple more things down. Let's get our feeder down. Because most of our dinos are going to end up going over here, I think. Actually, oh, that's right. We're building down below. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to build my living quarters right back here somewhere. Just like something simple with like a bed and stuff. Do I have the bed on me? I don't. But we'll build like the bed in here somewhere and kind of make some other things. But that's kind of what we're working with. Let's go, let's go out and just tame something. Let's go have some fun. We need to go out and do something fun. It's been a little stressful with all the craziness on the server. With the server crashing and then I had computer work to do these last two days. That's the most I've had to mess with the computer since I got it. So it was kind of a bummer. And it was just a huge learning experience because it's not something that I've messed with a lot. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What are we doing? We got a mantis. Now, we'll, I will do all the dino names in the next couple of days once I get everything placed out. I was going to do it in this video, but I want to wait until I get enough space to put all my dinos out like the UD and everybody else that you guys gave awesome names for. Thank you for that, by the way. All right, hold on. Where's my dino storage? Downstairs? But I'm liking the base outlook so far. I'll give you guys a good flyby here in just a second. Let's get our mantis. All right. Mantis. And our owl. There we go. All right. Let's go owl and mantis. Now we need to make sure each of you has a tracker. All right. Like this. And a pickup ball if you don't have one. You don't have one. So let's do a pickup block. I already have one. There we go. All right, let's do pickup. And then we'll get a tracker on you. Oh, you already have a tracker. Okay. And pick up for when we need it. All right. We didn't put the tracker on this guy. Hold on. Technical difficulties. Oh, maybe we did. Okay. I didn't know we did. Uh, let's see. I think... I think we'll go ahead and pick you up. Let's go show everybody the base real quick. All right. Check it out, guys. So the, here's what we got base-wise real quick. I think it's starting to look kind of good. Let me see. It's not too bad, right? Oh, let's get all that out of the way. There we go. It's not bad. It's starting to look kind of like a thing. We'll definitely get into some more stuff really, really soon. So we're going to kind of just cruise this way and see what we can tame real quick. No particular thing that we're searching for. Although that wouldn't be bad. If we found an Alpha Carno, I pretty much wouldn't mind anything Alpha range. That would be a lot of fun. We're not quite ready for Prime, guys. We'll get into that soon. We could probably tame one, but I just... I, we don't really have the... Oh, you know what? I don't have any food. Hold on. We got to go back. All right, go back. Oh, do we even have a teleporter? There we go. Let me go back and get some food made up. We're trying to do this kind of in one shot today. I'm, gonna, I'm hoping to try and do a quicker video today because of how long we had to work on the computer. I haven't got any recording done, but hopefully we at least updated you guys with stuff. Let's see what we can make on the eternal bench real quick. All right. There we go. Can we make any of the meat? Meat. I don't know that we can. We can make one of those. Is that it? We can only make one at a time. Okay. All right. That is it. So I've got three and two. Not much, but hopefully it'll at least get us going. And then if we can get a good face eater. We have the Mantis. He can definitely do some damage. But if we can get a little bit better, because I don't want to level his melee up at all. If we can find something that can do a little bit better melee, I think we'll be in business. I would love to find an Alpha Rex, because we did get gifted an Alpha Rex from Little Can. And we did get one from uh, that we tamed in between episodes. But I want to do one with you guys before we can break it out. Alright, let's find us something cool. Eternal Alpha would be cool. This is always such a dangerous area. You gotta be really careful. What are you? Corrupted Rock Drake. Now, Alpha Rock Drake, maybe. Here we go. What's this? Corrupted Rock Drake. Now, I hear you. Not worried about you. We could do another Alpha Raptor if we find an Alpha Raptor. We got one tamed in the last episode right before we went through the ceiling. That was a huge bummer. I was actually completely shocked about it. 
All right, what do we got? Uh, Eternal Raptor, no. Come on. Where are all the amazing guys at? There was a Dino Wipe really, really recently, so that might be part of this. All right. Let's fly like this so we can see a little better. We've got to be a little careful coming over here next to Teru's base. She's got that gigantic base over there that's going to take 10 minutes to load in. All right. Tusk, though, problem. Sorry about the fog, guys. I know it's really foggy. There we go. Get rid of that. Oh, there we go, guys. That is it right there. Alpha Rex. Yes. That's what we were looking for. This is always a good spot for them. They seem to spawn here a lot. All right. Let's do a quick switch. No, 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 no. Don't fall down. Okay. Let me go like this. I'm going to go pick up, but we're going to whistle you passive just in case. All right. You still have the pike, right? Because we don't have any other way to do this. I don't have arrows anymore. We lost everything in the last episode. All right. Here we go. Let's go. You're not attacking. Why? Oh, okay. There he goes. All right. We'll wait for that to go up. Okay. Okay. We're doing okay. He's kind of trapped back there. How much meat are you going to take? Uh, five and seven. Dang. Okay. We're not going to get a great tame out of it, but it'll be okay. Oh, watch your health. Are we stuck back here? Nope. Get out. Get out. Get out. There you go. Reset it. Oh, he's kind of stuck. Perfect. Hopefully it's that, not server. Nope. Okay, we're good. There we go. 1.4, guys. 1.6. He's running. We're about to go down. Reset it. He should go down. Oh, penguins. All right, you almost down? He's down, guys. Yes. Well, let's get this Barry on us to come over here. Hey, Barry. Come here. Barry. Okay. We'll go ahead and hit you. All right. Anything else going to come scare me? All right. So his food is down. He needs seven alpha meat and five prime meat. I have three and two. <laughs> So we're going to be somewhat close. We're going to need some prime. Okay, now I think this pick that we have gets us better meat. Let's find out. Oh, wait. Where's our pick? Oh, pick. Come on. Oh, God. Why can't I? Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, God. Don't die. Don't die. Come on, dude. All right. That was a waste. Hey, come here, dude. Come on, come on, come on. My dude, what's up? There you go. There you go. All right, got you. All right, let's try this again. I think they ate the frog before I got a chance to even pick him. We can go get a couple of these parasers. This would be a quick knockout. Let's go a little bit of melee. There you go. All right, we'll kind of just take out everything. We'll get quite a bit. There we go. All right, take this guy out. Okay, we get 80 prime from that. That's not bad. That'll get it done. Let's take all these guys out, and then we'll go back and get that Rex. There we go. All right, sweet. Let's go get this Rex. Should be ready to go now. All right, let's see. As long as these piranhas aren't going to get us again, are we good? All right, so we'll put the good meat on first. Anything good coming to get us? All right, good meat first. Oh, my God. Are you serious? Come on, dude. Nope. Oh, my God. That was close. There we go. All right, hold on. I do have potions. We almost didn't heal. Okay, heal up. All right. The good meat. The less good meat. And... Oh, my God. Stop it. Ah! 
Oh, he's up. Oh, we had enough. Oh. Wow, okay. It definitely didn't seem like we had enough. Hold on. Oh, I don't have a soul ball gun. Do I not? Hold on. Oh, yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. We're good. Okay. And, no, we didn't get any meat back. That's okay. We got it out for Rex, guys. We have our first face eater. Now we can go do some damage. This guy can knock all the things out. The Alpha Rex will be able to eat everything for us. All right, we'll go through just a little bit further and see if there's anything else that we can tame right here. Other than that, we're going to head back. Okay, big battle against a, an Alpha Giga. Not something I was planning on getting today, but we'll do it. All right, we're about to hit a million. Oh, we need to eat. We need to eat. There we go. We also need to heal. There we go. 1.4. This dude's about done. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. Come back, dude. There we go. 1.8. 1.9. Oh, we just talked about this. We don't have the stuff to tame him. <laughs> well, oh man. He's only a 560. He's not perfect tame. I can't do that, though. Hmm. Okay, no problems. So I guess we're not going to tame anything else because I don't. I just don't have the meat for it right now, which is why we need to do a like boss run. There we go. Make sure everything is gone. All right, there we go, guys. Let's get get over here and see if we can make. Hopefully, I can at least make a. What is that? If I can make a Rex. Hold on. Let's drop this. There we go. All right, can I make a Rex saddle? Let's see. Oh, I love this thing. I'm going to comment on that every time I go through it. It's so awesome. All right. Let's go with a Rex saddle. All right, Indominus Rex, regular Rex. Got it. Yes. All right, so that takes one Dino Heart. All right. Let's go ahead and get our new buddy out. Here we go. Good job, Mantis. Oh, you know what? I can look real quick while we're waiting. I can look to see if there's already a name for the Mantis. Let's see who wins right now. Uh, let's see. <laughs> name for the Mantis from Nature Guy is Slasher. So someone else might have left me the comment. That's literally the first one that popped up when I came to YouTube. So there you go. Your name is Slasher. So let's go TVFG. Oh, no, no. TVFG. Slasher. There we go. Nice. Slasher it is. All right, let's go ahead and get the Rex out. Yeah, man, it's about to do some things now. We're about to go wreck some things. Now, we still got to be careful of a couple things. There still are bad things that can eat us, but I do have Rexes now that I can do Rex babies also. All right, first test. Do we take fall damage? Please don't take fall damage. We take a little, but it's not much. All right, easy, easy. Let's go eat some things, see what we're doing. All right, so starting stats before we bite on anything. We're sitting at 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1.5 million health, which sounds like a lot, but there's things out there that can one-shot us easy. Melee, 725, movement speed, 100, everything else, who cares? We know he's got weight. We know he's got oxygen. Here we go. 10,000. Look at that. He's doing the same as the Mantis, and the Mantis has actually leveled up a little bit. Yeah. Oh, my God. This guy's going to be amazing, guys. All right, let's get all of those into melee. And we're going to start getting some really good drops, too. All right, he's got the yell. Let's see what we got else. Here we go. Eat this guy. 20,000 already. Yeah, get him. All right, C button. No, C button just also does the thing. X button, same thing. Control, same thing. Okay. We got some good drops out of that, though. All right, from that one Alpha Carno, we got 20-something levels. Now, the amount of levels that we can put on top of these guys is something crazy, like several hundred. Wow, huge XP. Let's make sure we take that. We'll take all that stuff. All right, let's go eat some things over here. What do we got? Corrupted Rock Drake. Let's do it. And a Prime. We'll eat the Prime also. All right, here we go. 44,000. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this guy does a little more damage. Oh, be careful. How much health does he have? Okay, 500,000. We can do it. We can do it. 
Just gotta watch our health. Oh, he does he does good damage. Oh no 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 poison guy. No 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 no. Get back. Get him back. Oh god. Oh don't you freeze now, server. No no. Okay, we're good. Alright, dino hearts, nice. Oh my god, poison rock drake. That dude is brutal. Does the potion get rid of that? I don't think so. No, not that. That one. It does not. We're gonna have to go get poison. We're gonna need a poison reducer. Come on. What do we need for the poison stuff? There's a potion. Poison eraser is rare mushrooms. All right, we're going to the uh, swamp. Go into the swamp. Try to avoid all the things that do poison. All right, we got some more levels. Let's go a little bit of speed, a little bit of melee. Oh, there we go. Look, poison eraser. Nice. Okay, if the poison goes back up, we'll use it. All right, damage now. 52,000. And you'll notice that our levels are going to start going up quite a bit too. We should hit level 100 like in the next few minutes, I'm hoping. And we, we still can't unlock tech or anything like that until we beat some of the eternal bosses though. All right, guys, I just wanted to try out the crystal pick on these trees. Yep, rare mushrooms, perfect. That can help us get some of these potions going. There we go. So now I can make a few of these poison race potions because we're a little worried about that. Let's go... Oh, God. What are we doing? Uh, Poison. Oh, we can't have to make it on the eternal bench. I don't know why I was thinking we could do it on our inventory. That's fine. We'll go back and do that here in a minute. Oh, man, all kinds of stuff there. There you go, guys. Getting some really, really good gear. Man, that's what, that's what I'm talking about. First face eater. We can do all the things now. Oh, no, 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 no. We got problems. Oh, spawn on death mechanics. Getting us. Run, 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 run. Oh, my God. Giant gorilla chasing us. Nothing I can do. There we go. Water. Water's the savior. Oh, no. Okay, that's fine. Kamikaze. Escape the gorilla. We're safe. Uh, please don't hit the water. I mean, not the water, but the land. Yeah, we escaped. <laughs> oh, my God. That was almost a disaster. There we go. All right, let's get out of the water. And we'll teleport home. That was almost a huge disaster. That, that gorilla could wreck our face right now. All right, let's go back home. Bam. Oh, I see the... Lil Can's airship is somewhere close to us. All right, guys. There you go. The Rex. And you already know what we're going to start doing right away. Let's go ahead and park over here. I'll finish off the fence on the other side so we'll be pretty safe in here. Let's go Rex right here. Let's see if we got these other Rexes. Let's see if we got a female Rex. All right. Heal up. There we go. All right. Let's see. Rex. Oh, no. What happened to our other Rex? We should have one more. So this is the one from Lil Can. All right, let's go like this. There we go. Female and male. Yes, let's get it started. So there you go. Lil Can, thank you for the Rex. Oh, no. Here we go. And... Oh, why can't I get you to... Behavior mating. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to need you guys to make a baby. There we go. All right, I think the egg was made. Let me see. we got to get ourselves an air conditioner and a hatchery and all kinds of things. Let me see. The egg. There we go. Rex egg. Ready to go. Uh, I don't know what happened to our nannies. Forgot to make another nanny, so I'm going to go around and cut some hair. But that's going to do it for today, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed today's episode. I'm really excited about the Alpha Rex. We're definitely going to continue to level this guy up. And guess what? As we get babies... This guy evolves. We can evolve him into some elemental stuff. We can have a good time with it. Can't wait to do that. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Like, comment, subscribe, all those kind of things. You guys are awesome and amazing. It is indeed a thing. We can't even get our own outro right. It is indeed a thing, guys.